Get your mind right and chill. 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 Hey y'all, welcome to Hot Life, your number one show for urban news, gossip, and everything in between. I'm your host, B. Will. Today we are on the rooftop in the beautiful city of New Orleans. Yes, it's time for a vacation. The highlight tour continues. Have you ever graced the streets of Canal and Bourbon? Even though it smells like a porta potty, it's a beautiful vibe for the culture. Many people of different races and ages, blues music, great food, amazing daiquiris, and there wasn't a gun in sight. It was kind of hard for me to adjust to a big crowd because big crowds in Birmingham equal danger. If you haven't been to NOLA yet, it's an experience you will not forget. don't want to hang out on bourbon there are many other things to do like paddle boats the voodoo museum and the aquarium appreciate the creatures of the sea with your loved ones an up close personal look inside the ocean when it's time to travel especially if it's out of the u.s you may need some assistance and that's when you contact a professional my name is Beverly Ashley McCurdy, and my business is BAM Travel Suites, which is a um, full service providing travel agency. Well, I always like to travel. Um, I travel even as a child. My parents always took us on vacations every year. And um, when I got older, we never like cruised or went out the country when I was a child. My mom didn't want to fly and get on boats. And so I um, decided when I got older, I wanted to do some different traveling. And I came across a travel agent. And after my first trip that she booked, she introduced me to the business and it just went from there. My favorite part of being a travel agent is my clients having a flawless experience. I travel a lot and I always make sure my trips are up to par and I don't leave any um, T's uncrossed and the I's not dotted. So my, just the favorite part is just my clients being able to have a really good travel experience, enjoy their trip, have fun and not stress. Been to a lot of the major cities in the United States, um, of course, Miami, Vegas, Chicago, New York. Um, as far as at the country or cruising, I've been on 12 cruises. So I've cruised a lot in the Caribbean and the Bahamas. And then I've been to Dominican, Cancun, Cabo, Jamaica. I've been to all of those places. Sent people to those places as well. A lot of people really like Jamaica. Um, I think it's because of the culture and the vibe with Jamaica and it's just typically a really a place that everybody wants to go once in their life. It's their dream place, they're on their bucket list. Um, my particular, my favorite place is, would be Dominican Republic. I like the Dominican Republic. The people there are very nice, very down to earth, always memorable and respectful and then the beaches there are some of the best beaches in the world. I have a small team of agents and I do sign people up to be agents. Um, they could just reach out to me and 
I'm a very honest and transparent person, so I do explain to them what they can expect because I don't want people to think that you just jump into business, you start making a bunch of money. It does not work that way. You have to learn about the business, learn about traveling so that you can explain things to your clients because you are their expert. And so if someone wants to be an agent, um, they will contact me and I would explain to them how the business works. I do tell them to give themselves at least a year to learn about everything before they start um, seeing profit. I have a business phone number and I am on social media platforms on Facebook and Instagram. It's BAM Travel Suite, B-A-M Travel Suite. Um, and then also I have a business phone. My phone number is 205. 913-9150 and I have a booking platform where I can assist you with booking all your travel or if you want to talk to me about being a travel agent. It's not hard being a travel agent. It's just that you have to understand that things happen and things change all the time and your client's issues become your issues. Your client misses their flight. Your client gets sick on their trip. Your client needs to change their trip. You are the one that's supposed to take care of that. So you have to be always ready for the unexpected because you just never know. Like when Kobe hit last year, I didn't know that. And I spent a lot of time changing trips and canceling trips. You just have to always be prepared for the unexpected. It's a, a very, um, it's just a position that can, anything can happen at any time. You know, most days are good, but sometimes Days are long and things may come up. I think it's important for people to take vacations because it gives them an escape from everyday life. A lot of people tend to just do, you know, their textbook work, kids, husband, wife, and home, and that's it. They never take a break to enjoy the fruits of their labor. They never take that time to just really unwind and, uh, and relax. I think it's very important. And then also, I also specialize in luxury and quality vacations. I believe when you travel, especially if you don't travel a lot, you should definitely go somewhere and have nice accommodations. Get the swim out room, get the ocean front room, get the jacuzzi tub, you know, splurge a little bit to enjoy, really enjoy yourself so that, you know, you can relax and unwind and it just gives you a break. So I think they're important because they give you a break from your everyday busy lives. We usually are leading busy lives dealing with our family, work and stuff like that. Something else I do want to add, I know a lot of people ask the question like, why do I want to use a travel agent? A lot of people think that travel agents are here just to find you a deal. Let me just tell you that that is not how it goes. As travel advisors, um, I can speak for myself. I do more than that. I do more than just book your trip. Um, you have schedule changes, I fix that. You need to change your trip, I do that. Change your destination. You as my client never have to worry about anything. Any issues come up, good, bad, whatever, I'm able to help you with that. A lot of people don't understand it. They think it's just about finding a deal and it is not about that. You have a point of contact throughout your whole trip. While you're on the trip, when you get back, anything I, sometimes i have clients that have issues or things that come up and they're back and we're still trying to figure it out i have a client for example that went out of town in february and due to the storm her flight got canceled um, we had to file an insurance claim they just got their checks two weeks ago february was months ago so sometimes things are still going on after the trip i'm there for you you don't have to pick up a phone you don't have to do anything i'm still there to support you throughout the entire process so i want people to understand that that is what a travel advisor is it's not just finding the best deal it's to help you with the entire experience which is why my um saying is less hassle more travel because you focus on the travel i focus on the hassle my name is beverly ashley mccurdy my business is bam travel suite and stay tuned to high life this your boy ken xl make sure you stay tuned to high life with my home girl b will shout out to my my homie b will you know what I'm saying? high life <laughs> high life hey, well, hey. high life nigga i mean high life it's your girl Shawana Shane with Stolen's Love. You are now tuned in to the High Life. We can't talk about New Orleans without mentioning their spiritual practices. It's scary to some, but most people have the wrong idea of what voodoo is. The word voodoo means spirit. It is a religion practiced in parts of the Caribbean and southern U.S. 
combining elements of Roman Catholic ritual with traditional African magical and religious rites. Voodoo was created by slaves to stay closer to their heritage as their masters forced them to convert to Christianity. Most people assume it's satanic or evil, but do your research and be open to learn new things. New Orleans, thanks for showing High Life a great time. We will be back again. Where do you think we should visit next? Let us know in our email, highlifetvshow at gmail.com. Until next time, stay safe and positive. I'm B. Will with High Life in the beautiful city of New Orleans. Can't wait to meet you in the clouds. So you, when he's, when he cheat and his eyes is wandering, you just walk past the, it's your funeral, babe. You put it on his mind. See, you ain't gotta argue, you ain't gotta fight, you ain't gotta get all upset. You ain't gotta throw nothing, you ain't gotta do none of that. If you wanna play around, if you wanna cheat right now, Get your mind right in shit, watch Get your mind right in shit, watch Get your mind right in shit, watch The wisest man in the world learns that he's not as wise as he thinks Because it's always something he can learn, even from a baby And to my Nubian queens, quit calling each other bitches You don't have any tails that's wagging, so when it insults, they come a greedy And to my brothers, we calling each other niggas Quit running around with guns Cause only dummies run around with guns that want to crash